course, no surprise. And it is cold outside. Temperatures just 6 or 7 degrees outside the showers. But, of course, the impact is being made by that northerly gale. It's bitterly cold, certainly in northern Scotland. Minus 10 degrees Celsius here. And those winds, well, those will continue to blow. Blow snow showers into the north and east of Scotland, even at lower levels. But also some showers, wintry showers, across parts of Northern Ireland, Wales, eastern and western parts of England blowing around as well that snow treacherous on the roads because of the strength of the wind so the radar picture shows you where the showers are at the moment you can see them in the north and east of Scotland peppering Northern Ireland much of Wales and southwest England and we could even see a dusting of snow over the Lincolnshire walls in the next couple of hours but if you do have shelter from that northerly wind through southwest Scotland northwest England for example some crisp winter sunshine and as the showers ease and the winds ease in the west tonight it's going to turn cold a sharp frost tonight and some ice after the showers but in eastern areas those gales will continue if anything they'll strengthen severe gale force winds possible down the north sea coast driving in, driving in more sleet and snow showers through the night and the risk increases of snow further south perhaps into kent so through parts of the east midlands too over the chilterns and the downs come tomorrow morning and the winds too give a concern because they could strengthen further gusts up to 65 miles an hour in these areas tonight and there'll still be some strong winds and showers around in the east tomorrow but starting to see a change in the west high pressure starts to move in these weather fronts here bringing more cloud into western scotland but for many a drier brighter day tomorrow after an early frost so a few wintry showers though in eastern areas and a cold night too but then the frost looks set to disappear as we head into the weekend and that's because we're going to see much milder air coming in off the atlantic so temperatures will recover on saturday we'll start to see some more rain patchy rain getting into the northwest a lot of cloud elsewhere but some drier weather and then with a the weather front draped across us on sunday there'll be quite a bit of cloud around and also the risk of severe gales up in the northwest of scotland so some wintry showers still here otherwise as you can see much milder than we've seen just of late and then some wetter weather moving in as we head into the start of next week but for the meantime winter is upon us it will feel very cold if you're out today with wintry showers for many a widespread frost tonight some icy patches around and even a little sleet and snow dusting the hills down in the southeast for tomorrow morning before it turns